One of the symptoms of sleep apnea is that people are too tired and they're often exhausted and they might fall asleep at a stoplight or worse, fall asleep while they're driving. Um, they could um, just doze off at other times of the day when they're not intending to and they just know they're having a hard. Sometimes people don't feel that bad if they have a milder case of sleep apnea. Um, sometimes if they have a more severe case, they know they just feel terrible every day. So there's kind of a continuum, a spectrum of, of levels that people have, but it's very important to treat it even when you have a milder case because what can happen, the dangers of it, is that untreated sleep apnea is going to lead to hypertension, it's going to lead to cardiovascular disease, it has been linked with uh, the onset of type 2 diabetes, it, it has been linked with stroke, it's been linked with a lot of uh, terrible systemic effects that you know, people, don't, people don't want in their lives. And in fact, um, it's been proven that treating um, obstructive sleep apnea can extend somebody's life by seven to ten years so it's a it's a very significant uh, thing for people to consider and the the problem is that the vast majority of people in this country and in this world are undiagnosed they're undiagnosed they're, they they may think that they're they may not be so severe that they really are in the sleep doctor's office saying hey what's wrong with me but they may not feel great they may have, they may have a milder case of it and yet, if they don't treat it, those um, systemic effects are going to occur given enough time. So that's why it's important to get tested if, uh, if you do show signs and symptoms um, and or it, it, at our office we use a, a screener which actually helps to um, assess in the patient's own um, assessment of their sleepiness and also some physical markers to try to ascertain if the person has a high likelihood of having sleep apnea. And so we talk with you about that if we find that to be the case and, and decide if, if getting tested is the right thing for you.